Hey guys, it's Isabella. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome if you're new here. Today's video is going to be my fall bucket list. I have like 30 ideas for you guys to do this fall if you're looking for something to do or you just don't know what to do in the fall. I got your back. So if you want to see what is on my fall bucket list, just go ahead and keep watching this video. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Isabella, welcome. I really hope you stick around. Don't forget to click that subscribe button down below and turn on your post notifications by clicking the little bell icon. That way you're notified whenever I upload a new video and you don't miss out on any of my amazing fall content. I'm so excited that it's fall, guys. Like the temperatures are starting to drop here in Texas. So I'm super excited. With all that being said, let's go ahead and jump right into this video. So I have a list on my phone of everything of my my fall bucket list is right here. The first thing I have on my list is to go to a pumpkin patch. I love going to pumpkin patches and a few years ago like when Zach and I were first like first started dating, we got some great photos that my cousin Valentina took of us in a pumpkin patch that was at, at a church. So that was super cute. The second thing I have on here is to make apple cider. Um, I love apple cider, so that will definitely be something I will be doing this year. The third thing on my list is to take some cute photos. The next thing I have is to go to a haunted house. Obviously, this is in. This would be only available when it's October. It's September right now. But yeah, I personally don't like haunted houses. I don't like anything scary. But if you're into that, I figured I would just put that on the list anyway, just in case y'all are into that so the fifth thing i have on here is to plan out your halloween costume and the sixth thing i have on here is to host or go to a halloween party halloween parties are super fun and i love going to them and i love hosting them too even though they are a little bit of work because you know parties are just a lot of work in general but if you're up for it definitely do that i'm hosting one this year for my friends a small group of people I, the seventh thing on my list is to update your closet and like prepare for fall that means like if you have your like long sleeves and sweaters in like a certain drawer or like in storage it's time to get them out and put away your summer and spring clothes maybe have a few basic pieces out there like if the weather's like not too cold out to wear so you're not sweating but i live in texas in north texas so um the weather really varies here so i don't always i don't put my summer stuff up here during christmas it was like 70 degrees and so um I was wearing short sleeves. So um, the 11th one I have is to go to Bath and Body Works and pick up any of your favorite fall candles um, and like wallflowers, whatever, just like stock up because we all love those flannel candles, the mahogany teak wood, stuff like that. Just I love that. I love fall stuff. If you can't tell, fall is my favorite season. Like, I decorated my room. If you haven't seen that video, it'll be in the eye card somewhere. But, yeah, so I love fall. The next um, thing I have on here is to learn how to make some fall foods or meals. This could be, like, soups, chili. I love learning how to cook, and I'm starting to learn how to cook even more now that I'm going to be moving out and getting married and everything just because one of us has to learn how to cook. And Zach and I are trying to learn how to cook together. Oh, wait, the next thing I have is to make... Pillsbury cookies and y'all know what I'm talking about the ones with the jack-o-lanterns and the pumpkins and the, all the Halloween stuff Those are so cute and they're so delicious. Go apple picking is um, number 13. No number 14 on my list Number 15 is to drink hard apple cider. Obviously if you're 21 or older that's for y'all. 16th one I have is to go on a hayride. Um, I used to go to hayrides they had at my current church when I was younger. I went, they have like hayrides down like the field behind the church and those are really fun. I want to try to find a hayride that is not really associated with fall festivals at churches just to go with a larger group of friends where it's not a bunch of little kids going. Uh, 17 is to drink hot chocolate. So number 18 I have is to do a corn maze. I personally, I don't think I've ever done a corn maze in my life. I might have done one once but I don't remember if I have. It. I probably have it. That's something I want to do on there. Number 19 is to go fall decor shopping which I love doing. I love every year. I just love the fall aesthetic that like Target, Home Goods, CJ Maxx has. Just the vibe is like so, it's so my style. It makes me so happy. Speaking of that, how cute is this pumpkin? Gold and white and it's 
so cute and number 20 is paint pumpkins with your friends so I haven't done this before but I've always wanted to do this and um I don't think I've really I've carved a pumpkin once but I haven't painted one so that's why it's on my bucket list so I think that'd be fun uh, I'm probably gonna arrange to do that with like some of my close girlfriends Here's to go to a tailgate in high school I would go to um, football games with my friend Caroline and we would go on tailgates and it was just so fun so, yeah definitely go to the tailgate if that's your thing wear a flannel because it's flannel season y'all and I love flannels they're so flattering put bake something so maybe this isn't necessarily like bake cookies but you could bake banana bread you could br bake zucchini bread pumpkin bread or like cookies snickerdoodles are good cookies to make to get follow photos done like professionally if you want and if you can afford it i definitely know personally that since fall is my favorite season and um zach and i are getting married in the spring and we already have our engagement photos that were done in may you're gonna want to get some fall photos of the two of us done it always looks so good have a bonfire and then wear a cute fall sweater because the sweaters are adorable during this time of year. I love the colors. Make yes. s'mores is number 27. Love some s'mores. Watch a movie outside with some blankets because, yes, I haven't done that yet. Um, I think we need a projector screen or pro a projector thing so we can put like a sheet up on the, on the brick side of the house and just like do that. Go on a walk for number 29. Number 30. In Texas, the State Fair of Texas is held late September, beginning of October. So I put go to the State Fair of Texas or go to your State Fair if it is happening during the fall. And that is all that's on my bucket list, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give this video a big thumbs up for me and comment down below what your fall bucket list is for 2021. I would really love to know and maybe add to my own bucket list. Like I said, if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications by clicking the little bell icon so you never miss an upload from me. Don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok. They'll be on the screen right here. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a good day. Bye.